wonder what else is on here. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. But... Gordon heard about Batman's surprise visit to the mayor. He was far from happy. Thanks for the heads up. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hells, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To be honest, Alfred, nothing can shock me anymore. Not when it comes to my parents. I wish I felt the same way. But I suppose no good can come from wallowing. The city needs you now more than ever. I'll, uh, I'll leave you to it then. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path to the mayor's office. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors persist that the candidate is having trouble paying his campaign staff and making ad buys. A Dent spokesperson said these rumors are nothing more than a smear tactic perpetuated by the incumbent Mayor Hill's campaign. In other news, nobody goes to Gotham's dive bars expecting a quiet night out, but police say a brawl tonight at the Stack Deck Bar in Otisburg was the rowdiest one in recent memory. Reports say multiple arrests were made, with all the suspects taken into custody while unconscious. Police are seeking an unidentified man and woman who were seen in conversation with the assailants shortly before the fight. Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path to the mayor's office. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors persist that the candidate is having trouble paying his campaign staff and making ad buys. A Dent spokesperson said these rumors are nothing more than a smear tactic perpetuated by the incumbent Mayor Hill's campaign. In... Wait a minute. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguin's men may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We could just be looking at... What they want us to see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. Harvey needs to get out of there. Hey, Bruce. Man, I'm glad you called. I needed to talk to you, actually. Something's come up. Something that's... Well, it's not exactly pleasant. Why? why what happened? Are you all right? Me? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. No, oh, you mean because of this penguin threat. They have me in some back room until the debate begins. For my own protection, they said. A little bit of overkill, if you ask me. Uh, look, Bruce, I didn't want to do this over the phone, but my advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Until all this mess with your family blows over. There. I, I get it, it's the smart move, but let's talk about that later. I'm glad you see it that way. What with the allegations in the press, and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. But here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead in the water. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I may have to trash you in public. 
But you and me, we all know the truth about our friendship. You've got some nerve, Harvey. Either we're a team or we're not. No, of course we're a team, Bruce. Of course we are. Just... Not in front of the press. Listen, I hate to push you, but I... I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Whatever it takes to save Gotham, that's what we wanted. I'll always support you, Harvey. Oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. Uh, to Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. <laughs> Guess she needs to put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. Uh, no matter what I have to say tonight, remember... You are always my friend. <laughs> Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. But just so we're clear, you and me, we're on shaky ground. Jim, listen. No, listen to me. The excessive violence, it, it can't go on. Most of the GCPD already think you're a monster. Don't prove them right. You're lucky I'm on your side. Now that may be true, but I can't ally with a violent thug. We have bigger things to worry about right now. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. I'd keep that holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? We're all on the same side, Jim. Well, this better not come back to bite me. Alpha Patrol, come in. That, um, incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. Doing the right thing? Maybe there's hope for you yet. Don't read too much into it. I'm just allergic to owing you anything. None of my men on the ground are responding. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha, do you read? Now aren't you glad I'm here? Now you have a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. We are seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dent, Lieutenant. <laughs> Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our live debate for the next mayor of Gotham City. This is an important debate for these two candidates, incumbent Mayor Hamilton Hill and the challenger, Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent. And it's also important for you, the citizens of Gotham, who will soon head to the polls to decide the future of your home, a city that's faced its share of hardships in recent years. Rising crime rates, income inequality, and yes, a massive vigilante loose on our streets. At least we know why they weren't responding. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. They've been terminated. Oh, those goddamn sons of Sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. First order of business... Firing the moderator! 
I hate to be a downer, but these hostages... I don't like their chances. Oh, they just didn't have a head for the issues. Don't think about the odds or you'll make mistakes. You have to stay focused. <laughs> Speak for yourself, Batman. You'll do. Get out here. Keep it quiet back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there. Yes. You. Thank you for volunteering. Please. No. Go on, then. Introduce the candidates. Stage fright, huh? All right. I'll get you started. But this is your show. Three hostiles. Gotta take them out quietly. On the left! Power of hot! Sword in the shot! Power down in dirty incumbent! May I heal! And on the right! Always smiling to your face! Our despicable DA! Of his hands! Bird mask guy. Whatever your name is. Call me Penguin. Maybe next time. Keep your heads down. Make for the police line. And now, a word from our sponsor. My doubts are brothers and sisters of color. You have nothing to fear. We are the children of Arkham. We are here to end the masquerade and expose the corruption that ruined your city. For too long, men like your esteemed mayor have profited from the pain of innocence. This is spiraling out of control. They have no idea about the man behind the mask. Whoever it is, they're smart. Let someone else get their hands dirty. Look into the hearts of these spineless creatures. Go on, love. You know what to do. Ah! Thank you. 
Subject 9, Esther Cobblepot. You've been declared criminally insane and committed to Arkham indefinitely as a ward of the state. Please, I'll sell you the land. Please don't do this. You had your chance. You should have made the deal we offered you. Give her the drug. Thomas, we were, we were friends. Our boys play together. You were warned, Esther. You know I always get what I want. Commence the procedure. Give her a dose she won't come back from. <laughs> now you know. Now you will see. an entrance.
paramedics over here, now! City Hall is in chaos after Mayor Hamilton Hill was confirmed dead. While several members of the Children of Arkham have been arrested, the Penguin is still at large. He won't be the same after this. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. Lawyers representing Bruce Wayne have no comment at this time. We are the children of Arkham, and we have opened your eyes. 